Sash My Eagles, it's Mrs. B again. I am here to do another art project with you this week. I'm really excited about this one. Um, we are going to be making Costa Rican Baruca masks. And I have a video in the comments that you should look at first to um, familiarize yourself and learn a little bit about these masks um, that the Costa Rican people make. Um, so, pause the video and go look at the other video so you know what we're making. And um, in the meantime, I also wanna tell you the materials that um, you will need for this lesson. Um, you'll need a piece of paper right there um, just to make a sketch of your mask. You'll need some paint. You'll need um, some sort of tape or glue, Elmer's glue. Um, we're going to make these masks 3D, which means they're going to be coming off the page. Um, and if you have any toilet paper rolls, go check right now how much toilet paper you have. See if you can um, get a roll. It doesn't have to be big. Um, this is a, a whatever towel roll, but you can get toilet paper rolls. And if you have straws or um, extra paper, actually, you don't need straws, but you could roll up paper. But we're going to make um, eyebrows and stuff out of um to get, or tinfoil or something, to get um, some of the features of the mask popping off of the mask. So, last but not least is a little bit of cardboard. I'm actually using um, cereal boxes, if you have, or recycle any cereal boxes. That's kind of about the right weight, but also if you have corrugated cardboard, that's awesome too, that's more sturdy. Um, but we're, just for cutting purposes and whatever, um, a, a cereal box or some sort of food box will be great for this project. Okay, so watch the video, um, see what these masks are made of, and possibly um, start to sketch your mask on your piece of paper with some pencil. And you can even color it in to know what colors you want to paint it. And that is the first part of our project. If you see here, I um, most of the masks are made from animals, Costa Rican animals. And I decided, because I have a bunch of feathers that I'm going to do, this is my drawing. I'm going to make like a peacock head or some sort of bird head. And so I kind of sketched it out, um, how I want the head to look. But you guys can make, um, if you look in the video, there's lots of jaguars, there's tigers, there's lions. You can make whatever kind of mask you want, penguin, whatever. So those are the three things I need you to do. Gather your materials. Um, sketch out a mask after you watch the video, okay? And then start part two. Bye!